Freiburg's disease. Freiburg's disease is caused by avascular necrosis of the head of the second metatarsal. It is more common in patients who have a longer second metatarsal bone relative to the first metatarsal. This leads to the transfer of excessive loads onto the second metatarsal, which may interfere with the blood supply. The condition tends to occur more commonly in young females during growth spurts. The patient is usually a younger female complaining of pain and swelling at the second metatarsophalangeal joint that is related to activities and walking in high heels. On examination, there may be point tenderness and swelling over the head of the second metatarsal. Furthermore, there may be limited range of motion in the second metatarsophalangeal joint. Regarding radiology, early in the disease, x-rays may only show minimal changes and radiological evidence of the condition may only be clearly visible on MRI and bone scans. In more severe cases, sclerosis, fragmentation, collapse of the metatarsal head, and severe arthritis could be easily visible on plain x-ray. Conservative treatment usually consists of non-steroidal anti-inflammatories, activity modifications, the use of orthotics such as a metatarsal bar, and immobilization in a short leg cast. Surgical treatments such as interventions involving joint debridements are only indicated after failure of all conservative measures. Other procedures may be indicated depending on the complexity and severity of the case. This video is for educational purposes only. Please consult your doctor before you make any decision about your medical care.